Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Lego Lee 329 here, and my most recent I'm going to college update video, I mentioned that I had a mock video coming up soon. Well, here it is. This is the mock that I'm showing off. This is my custom Lego music store. Now, between now and Brick Fair, which is, you know, a little bit less than a year away for 2016, I am planning on making kind of like a main street of different stores and different mocks. And the first one that I completed here is my music store. I'm also working on a Mexican restaurant, a Chinese restaurant, a comic book store, a Halloween store. Lots of things are to come. But the first store that I pretty much completed, now I'm sure I'm going to modify this in the future, but for right now I have my first draft of my music store. And I'm pretty happy with how it came out. We'll talk about the more interesting parts first, but just to get it out of the way, we're going to flip this thing around and you can see how great it looks from the back. This thing is going to be having stores on either side, so there's no reason really to have this part look good, the back to look good, or to this look good. The gray parts are just holding things on the wall. So that's the store from the side, so let's talk about the more interesting parts. Now, I struggled with how I was going to make the front of this. There's one idea that I had was to make this really simple, which I think would be the more realistic approach, and then I was like, or maybe I could do it like the Lego modular buildings and make it really ornate and detailed and really cool. It would definitely look cooler as a model and be more interesting architecturally, but that was just a little bit too unrealistic, so I kind of met in the middle. I added some weird architecture and direct decorations in here, but I decided to go for a pretty simple approach to the front of this building. There's a little bit of sidewalk down here. One of my favorite designs is the brick outlining the bottom right here, and I like the indentation right there. I think it did a pretty good job with that. Here is the front door, which of course can't open, and there's a window that can peek onto the inside. You can see I have two guitars being displayed in the window right there, like this archway over the window. These decorations I thought just looked kind of cool. Kind of went for a weird gold look, some more gold up here. I like the nougat color quite a bit. And if you saw my review of the Pop Store recording studio, I said I was gonna steal that note, and that's what I was using for. It's the logo from a music store right here. I was maybe going to make something spelled out of Lego letters, but I think this note just looks so good I decided to steal that. So I have to give credit to the Lego designer who did that because this looks perfect for this music store. Now getting to the interior, unfortunately I didn't have enough tiles in tan, so the interior is a little bit harder to access than I would like you to take off all of these plate pieces right here. Then there's two giant ones up top here that you also have to remove. But now you can start to see the interior of this music store. It's not too big, but it is tiled off with dark tan tiles, which I really do like. You can start to see the back wall in here. There's the golden record from the friend set, and this is the cashier's desk that actually can be pretty easily removed. Not a great design. Didn't work too hard on this. I wish I had a better piece for the capture center. This is actually just a computer piece from a different Lego set. And there's some headphones underneath the counter right here for sale. Back in the corner here is a small bin holding a musical sheet, a couple of drumsticks, and I believe there's a microphone hidden somewhere in there. And speaking of drumsticks, there actually is a drum set, a custom drum set that I made just for this mock for sale in the store. It's a little hard to see, but I'm pretty happy with how that came out. I think it looks pretty good. Of course, I got the cymbal right here, the drums that you would expect. There's a seat behind there, and I'm very happy with how that drum set came out. And of course, that's the biggest instrument available in this store. But as you saw in the window, this store sells guitars. I have two guitars on the wall back here. I don't have another guitar. I kind of lost mine. I used to have a black version of this, but I have no idea where I put that. But there are two guitars on the wall back there. And of course, there are two in the window right there. And there's a small seat for people who want to test out the guitars can in the actual store, which I'm pretty happy how that came out. Then besides that, there's the place that holds up the guitars right here. There's a small little doormat in brown, and the breast thing is just tiles. So there's actually a couple of small accessories that I also built off to the side that can go in the store. There's a microphone stand, which is very similar to the one that came with the friend set, and then pretty much the exact same design that came with the friend set for this amplifier, just minus some of the weird pastel colors. So these things can be put in the store, but they're kind of just loose out right now. Well, guys, there you have it. There is my custom Lego music store. Please tell me your thoughts down in the comments below. Now, I worked pretty hard on this, so don't just go out and say, your mock sucks, Lee. If you think it's bad, give me reasons and maybe I can improve in my upcoming mocks that I will be working on over the next year 
or so. Do you guys want to see more of these mock videos? There was some great reception to my Jurassic World mock video, so if you want to see more of this stuff, I will make more of it if you guys want me to. Tell me the designs you liked here. Tell me the designs you didn't like, where I can improve, and what I did well. I'd love to hear all of that in the comment section down below. Also, don't forget to like this video, favorite the video, share the video with all of your friends. Also, go like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and follow me on Instagram. Please subscribe to this channel, and I hope you see you guys next time more mock videos. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Where do you